Hi guys, um, this is a new one for me. I've eaten a lot of hot stuff, um, curries, pizzas, noodles, peanuts, um, toes of Satan's and all sorts, but my mother thought it'd be a good idea to buy me the world's hottest lager. It's made with naga chilies. It's called Black Death, which uh, don't sound too appealing to be honest. Um, it says black in colour, the beer is an oatmeal stout, which sounds disgusting. I mean, if it's anything like wheat beer, it tastes like a funeral. Um, with extreme heat of naga chilies, naturally carbonated. Uh, warning, seriously hot beer, strictly for people who can stand extreme heat. This product contains alcohol and must be sold to anybody under the age of 16. Please drink responsibly. Well, if you think sticking naga chilies in your beer is drinking responsibly, then uh, you're very much mistaken. Um, I've chilled this beer, although I've put it back in the box. I thought it would uh, look better if I showed you the box. It says, uh, are you tough enough? We will see, because to be honest, I'm only drinking it because my mother got, got it for me. I wouldn't, uh, I don't think I would have bought this myself, to be honest. That's where it comes with the glass. And close this up. There's a glass. I've already washed this. There's to, to wash the glass. I've already chilled this beer, so which seems a little bit odd. Chilling something that's got chili in it. So it's called Black Death. There it is. Let me uh get a decent thumbnail. That'll do. Um, it's four point five percent. Says our beer, our beers are handcrafted in Rittle, Essex. Uh, we produce a small batch using only the finest ingredients from around the world. No chemicals or preservatives are used. Okay, our beers are live, naturally carbonated, uh, and as such, will contain a small amount of sediment, which sediment because i've brewed my own over the years sediment is not good to to drink it's like a laxative uh, please pour carefully and leave the sediment and leave the sediment and ensure a perfect glass of beer okay i don't know if that's possible because we'll see anyway let's do it i, I really really don't what the hell's that i've washed this glass I really, really don't feel like drinking this. Like really. A little bit of water in there tipping into the tray. Might make me sick. I don't know. Never drunk chili beer. It smells like it smells like wheat beer, which is absolutely disgusting. I pour it carefully. Naga chilies as well, which is pretty hot chili. This is definitely going to give me the shifts. Oh my god. Well, I can't see any sediment, so it must all be in there. Look at that shit. Right. The bottom of the glass is rounded. That's not even a level glass. <laughs> oh, right then. <clears throat> so I just neck it? Or should I just sip it? It's called the Black Death. I mean, I'm drinking something called the Black Death. And I got it from my mother. That is disgusting. Oh my god. That is foul. Ugh. It feels like you're drinking pepper. That is absolutely disgusting. Oh my god. Can I finish that?
Oh my god. Why why would you do that? Why would you make Oh my god, I can see the sediment floating in the top. That is disgusting. I mean it's not hot. It, 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 it tastes like somebody have poured pepper on a shit pint. And then poured the pint in an ashtray and swirled it around. I'm getting tastes of it's like drinking from an ashtray. I'm not sure if I can drink that. There's all bits floating in it. There's all if I spin that, I don't need don't know if you can see. But there's all bits of sediment floating in there. This is really gonna make me sick. Oh my god. Mum, why? Oh god. That is <laughs> that is fucking disgusting. What am I doing? Why am I why am I drinking it? Are you tough enough? Are you fucking dull enough? I think that's what I should say. I'm going to have to finish it, aren't I? What am I doing? Look at all the bits floating in it. What the fuck? It's going to give me the serious shit. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. I'm doing this for you guys, and I don't know why. <laughs> you know I don't kick up a fuss and stuff, but this, I mean, I got, I haven't got the best gag reflex when it comes to bits floating um, in stuff I got to drink, to be honest, and just the thought of it is making me want to just spew. Black Death with sediment. Um, Heat-wise, nonsense. I mean, it just feels like just feels like there's pepper. Um, but disgustingness-wise, fucking, it's way up there. Way up there. I I don't know if I can drink it. I've drunk most of it. Oh my god. Just the thought of it. I think I want to spew it up just so it's not in me. I think that's probably the best idea, to be honest. Oh my god. Right. If anybody sees this in the shop and thinks it's a good idea to buy it, don't. Don't buy it because it's fucking nonsense. It's just, it's just disgusting. It's absolutely disgusting. If you want to know what this tastes like, get a fucking can of carlin, pour in an ashtray, stick a tub of pepper in it, swill it round, and then pour it into a pint glass. Because that is what I'm drinking. Have you ever been like, woke up the next day at the party and swigged a can that was open and somebody had used it as an ashtray? Everyone has done that, surely. And uh, it's, that's what it tastes like, but with pepper. I don't know why I'm drinking it, I really don't. It's because I just don't like to be defeated. It's fucking rank.
That's the sediment. Can't drink the sediment. Can fucking see it. Oh my god. Right. Heat wise, Naga chilies. Um, Naga chilies are hot. There's a bit of a. It's not. It's not heat. It's pep. It's like pepper. I mean, it's not. Just feels like I've, I've had a spoonful of pepper. It's nothing like. It's nothing. Um, it's disgusting. It, I think I've just reviewed it. That, that's and my review is it's fucking disgusting. I think my mother paid ten pound for this. Um, it's a fucking rip off. Don't buy it. It's disgusting. The people who made it um, are also disgusting for, for even... Whoever tasted this and said, yes, that'll do, we'll sell that. Get another job, because you're shit at that one. Um, but I've drunk it. Now, my next challenge, let's get this shit out of the way, because I don't even want to fucking... And I got a glass with a skull on. I know Captain Jerk would like that. Um, let's get it out of the way. I'm not promoting those fuckers anymore. Might not even stick them on a thumbnail. Right. Now that's out of the way. Let's get the real fucking business. Um, I, I don't even know what I'm saying. I, I feel so sick. Right, I've got this from VAT19. I know a lot of you are probably aware of it. I've had it for a little while. It's the hottest chocolate bar in the world, apparently. The world's hottest chocolate bar. Um, it's 9 million Scovilles, the same as the, the Toa Satan. I think it's made with the same e extract. Which is pretty hot. I mean, it's pretty fucking hot. I'm not sure what the rules are. I'm not sure if you've got to... Uh... Some people say... Because it's tiny. I mean, let me just show you how small it is. Look at that. That is tiny. Some people say you've got to break the squares up and eat a square every minute. But do you really want to be sat there for 12 minutes eating little squares of chocolate? I think just whacking him off is, is the best option. So I've got that to do, which is uh, you know, pretty pretty spicy. And I've also got these bad boys. Um, I know there are a few of you waiting for me to do these. Um, and I'm waiting myself. I was going to do them today. But I've had that bottle of... Uh, nastiness the black death in the fridge for a couple of days my mother bought it for me i don't know maybe a week ago or something four days ago and uh i've been putting it off but i've been putting all of these off to be honest because since uh the toe was satan i've done a few other things noodles and stuff um but these are the real mccoy right my phone just died then um Oh, it didn't die. It ran out of memory. I had to delete some stuff. So, yeah, these are what I've got. I'm not going to eat them now, but these will definitely be my next challenge. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to test another feature that I've never used. Up in this corner, or this corner, one of these corners are going to be a little... I'm going to test the polling, um, the polling thing you can do on YouTube. I've never used it. Um, so I'll get you guys to decide. So I'm going to put hottest bar of chocolate in the world, or the hottest noodles in the world, you guys can click, and whichever gets the, the most votes will be the next one I do. So yeah, get clicking. Peace.